nervous about it. We know the FBI is involved and that they're trying to coordinate this with any chatter from extremist right or left or whatever kind of group. They say right groups, but who cares? Uh, extremist groups. What does that mean if this is a window into a problem of targeting these people because they were African-American? Is it an act of terror? Look, I don't think we have words strong enough to describe how evil this is. I mean, whatever words you want to put onto it, this man went into it, from what we've heard, he goes into a church, sits there for an hour, like you said, kills nine people, and then says to the, some of the survivors, I'm letting you live so you can go tell people what I've done. In my mind, look, there are no words strong enough to condemn that. Evil, terror, whatever we want to call it. This is horrific. It's almost unimaginable. These are the kinds of things you think, this shouldn't happen. You know, you, when, I'm sure you had a lot of viewers who woke up to this news thinking, how could this happen in America? How could this happen in South Carolina? How, I've been in Charleston. It's a, it's a wonderful community. It's a great state. We, we don't want to think this could ever happen in our country, in our communities, in our churches. It is senseless. And look, I, I suspect when they do catch, and I hope they catch this guy quickly, and I hope they bring him to justice quickly, I don't know that we'll ever really understand what was going on in his mind. I mean, it just we'll see. You know, we'll see what, what he says. We'll see uh, if he uh, had written anything. We'll see. How do you understand evil at this level? I mean, again, what, there's no rationale for going into a church. There's no rationale for taking innocent human life. There's no rationale. These people were in a Bible study. I mean, they hadn't, they hadn't offended anybody. They weren't doing anything. This was, th th there can be no trying to understand or explain away this kind of evil behavior. Let's see what he, let, when I catch him, let's see what he says. Let's see if he's got writings. Let's see if he's posted things online. But at the, at the root of this, this is evil. Mm -hmm. And at the root of this, uh, again, our hearts break. And I do hope that uh, this community will be able to find some comfort in their faith. There are certain questions I don't think we can understand this life. Uh, I think there are some, certain questions and, and until we meet God, and until we meet our Creator, you know, unfortunately, we know he's got a plan. We've got to have faith. I'm a Christian. The, 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 the men and women that were killed here were Christian. We believe in another life after this. Uh, we believe in God's kingdom and mercy and love and compassion for us. We believe that his son died on the cross for us. Some of these things, uh, unfortunately, can't make sense to us in this lifetime. And, and you're just left. I, I also 